Hello everyone, my name is Marty Cranacci and I'm the National Team Leader for the Advanced Manufacturing Team at Solicad. For those of you that are not familiar with Solicad, we specialize in technology that supports advanced manufacturing. We employ the largest team of industrial technology experts across Canada, in all time zones, and in both official languages. We believe in providing our clients the solutions they need to maximize the return on the technology investment. I would like to thank you for attending our first Advanced Manufacturing Expo and I'm excited to kick off our first day. The idea of this expo is to get together with Autodesk and Solicad industry specialists, industry leaders, and our partners to discuss what's going on in advanced manufacturing. We all know that the traditional trade shows we are so used to attending to see new innovation and technology have either been canceled or postponed. But that should not stop us from learning what's new in the advanced manufacturing world and how we can work together to become more productive and profitable. I hope you find the sessions informative thought-provoking and interesting. Today we have Tom Houle from Matsura Machinery USA who will help you supercharge your injection mold using hybrid 3D printing. Richard Stubley from Autodesk will explore CNC probing with Fusion 360. Aaron Kennett from Autodesk will look at driving industrial robots with PowerMill. And Trevor Cohn from Majestic Technologies will delve into TrueNest for advanced digital manufacturing. A couple of things I'd like to mention. I want to let you know that you can easily connect with your peers, speakers, and exhibitors using the one-on-one -on -one chat function on the left-hand side. Also, don't forget that on both days, we have a virtual expo open from 3 to 3.30, so please take some time and visit our partner booths for additional information. I would like to introduce our first speaker, Chris Crane from Autodesk, who will give our keynote open presentation. Chris will be discussing manufacturing industry trends, Autodesk's ongoing investment in their manuf manufacturing portfolio, and now Autodesk will be delivering the next generation manufacturing platform. Thanks for attending and enjoy our sessions. Hello everyone. Thank you for taking the time to join us today to explore the fantastic content that will be shared over the course of this event. Before we begin, I just want to take a minute to introduce myself. I am a technical specialist with Autodesk located in Barrie, Ontario. My journey with Autodesk began in 2014 when Autodesk acquired Delkin, bringing with it a vast amount of industry-leading manufacturing solutions to the Autodesk family. I have spent my career engaging with many skilled tradespeople and programming professionals from across different industries. Industries that I started my career in, from automotive to aerospace to machine tool manufacturers. The vision at Autodesk on the future of making things and delivering the next generation of intelligent connected solutions is very exciting. And with our outstanding partners like SolidCAD, supporting people of industry, we are well positioned to lead the way. I'm very excited to see where this technology is leading us. Without further ado, let's take a look at today's presentation. It's great to be here and many thanks for spending your time with us today. I hope it's going to be a good use of your time. This is a great opportunity for us to learn more about your business and your challenges and needs for both now and the future. It will also help you better understand how Autodesk sees the market and give you insights into what we are doing to help our customers enable their competitive differentiation. I want to cover three main topics. The manufacturing, industry and trends we are seeing at a macro level, Autodesk's ongoing investment in our current manufacturing portfolio for subtractive, additive, simulation, and generative design. How we are delivering the next generation manufacturing platform called Fusion 360 and why you should be paying attention to the opportunity it offers you. I hope it will make you think about some of your challenges and where we can potentially work together to find solutions. I'm happy to take questions at the end of each section or you could note them down for a discussion at the end. Let's think for a moment of all the current initiatives and pressures we are facing in our day-to-day -day business and personal lives. On the negative side, here are some of the challenges. Increasing world population, climate change, and carbon emissions. An aging workforce, increased global competition, disruptive business models. On the positive side, we have a lot of opportunities. Infinite cheap computing power, digitalization, new digitally native workforce. This New means of manufacturing and materials, automation, 5G, AI, and machine learning. These threats and opportunities are impacting both you and your customers. The question is, how are you going to respond? 
These macro industry trends are impacting manufacturers in three areas. The nature of products, the things you make, the technology available to help make these things, and the nature of the work your people will be asked to do. The things you make, whether products or buildings, need to be better suited to human needs. They need to be more customized, more configurable, more connected, and ultimately more valuable to the customer and the producers. We are seeing the rise of in-product as a service and the Internet of Things being used as a way to collect information that can be mined for insights to create more opportunity for better products and additional revenue streams. In the realm of making, new technology is being introduced, 3D printing, hybrid manufacturing, flexible and configurable factories, and new advanced materials. And work is changing as the processes of design and making converge across industries and industries themselves are converging. Construction is becoming more automated, more like manufacturing with prefabrication and modular building components. Teams and supply chains are increasingly connected. Digitally native workers expect a different experience and they demand access to the latest technology. How will you attract these people to work for you? New job types are being created to support these changes from data analysts to chief innovation and chief digital officers. These changes are not news to you. They are well documented in many publications and are a driver for Industry 4.0, digital factories, and many other initiatives. At best, they will be felt in the disruption across supply chains. At worst, we will see companies disappear. 50% of the Fortune 500 companies from 2000 have gone. Just think of what happened to Nokia and Kodak, just to name two. The question the manufacturing community is asking, what can I do to stay competitive in the face of disruption? What can we do to help manufacturers stay ahead of these changing times and turn it into opportunity for them? The reality is we have had to look at our own business in the same way and address the disruption we are facing in the IT industry. New, more agile disruptors with no legacy business to consider are trying to lure customers away. The rise of cloud-based solutions, software as a service models, subscription versus perpetual licensing, named user versus serial number licensing. Often when I tell people I work for Autodesk, they immediately say, oh, the AutoCAD company. And yes, that is true, but Autodesk is much more than that. We started disrupting and democratizing the market 38 years ago when the PC created the opportunity to move CAD off a mainframe and onto the desktop. AutoCAD disrupted the design, drafting, and engineering world, and the CAD revolution began. 38 years later, even as a 40 billion market cab company, we are still disrupting the market and growing like a startup. We disrupted the AEC industry with the BIM and Revit, and we are now the market leader in that space and have helped to change the way buildings are designed and constructed for the better. We believe our solution to how things will be manufactured in the future will have the same disruptive positive impact in manufacturing. Let's take a quick look at where Autodesk is today in manufacturing and where we are going. Over the past 15 or so years, we have invested over 1 billion acquiring world-class technologies in advanced manufacturing space, covering additive, subtractive, simulation, materials, and electronic disciplines with companies like Moldflow, Delcam, and NetFab. This brought a vast array of technology and expertise into Autodesk. We can now provide our customers with a broad, best-in-class portfolio across all advanced manufacturing processes and needs, from design exploration through optimization and simulation, additive and subtractive manufacturing to inspection and robotics, allowing our customers to plan, program, and produce anything using Autodesk solutions. We continue to invest across our advanced manufacturing portfolio. This shows some of the high-level themes the next few slides provide more granularity and a roadmap of intent. We continue to invest in our flagship PowerMill, PowerShape, PowerInspect, and FeatureCam brands. PowerMill 2020 is the fastest, most stable, most secure version ever. All of our subtractive offerings are also benefiting from the developments being made in our Fusion 360 platform as they are, they are all in the same kernel. All of our customers are have free access to Fusion 360 to help 
with tasks like model import from any CAD system, model repair, multi-physics analysis, jigs and fixture design, and even using the CAM capabilities for other CNC requirements. Many customers are using the Fusion 360 entitlement to replace SOLIDWORKS or MasterCAM, giving them superior next generation capabilities and licensing cost savings. As we continue to invest in our manufacturing solutions, PowerMilk continues to get better. We have defined a roadmap and a R&D intent. We will continue to improve the performances and capabilities in our products to ensure they remain best in class. Here are some of the high level topics we are working on with our extensive development team. We've added a viewer for better communication between the CAM programmers and the shop floor, full machine tool simulation and verification, test the safety of alternative tool assemblies, validate the key cutting parameters for each operation, such as step down, step over, feed rate, spindle speed, and we can check entry and exit positions for every tool path. As the capabilities and uses of additive 3D metal printing continue to grow, we are investing in our NetFab solution to provide tools for simulation, analysis, and manufacture. We are adding support for new machines, adding new materials, improving performance and providing interoperability with our Fusion 360 and generative design solutions. If you're thinking about looking into opportunities, metal additive manufacturing could bring you. We will be happy to discuss this more with you. Again, we have a roadmap for our R&D intent for our additive solutions, adding even more machine support, improved connectivity to third-party applications, more capability with tech techniques like DED, and greater interoperability with other CAM systems. The intent here is to expand connectivity, new connected machines, EOS, Form 3, 3L, expand integration with the manufacturing execution systems to automate and plan for additive production. We want to streamline interoperability between Autodesk software platforms, such as Inventor and Fusion. We want to de develop the depth of a technology with new materials and parameters, 316, MS1, and 15-5. We want to grow the process coverage to commercialize DED simulation and speak to the different types of processes, such as multi-laser and FFF. Even after 40 years, Moldflow continues to be the benchmark leader for plastic simulation with unrivaled accuracy in material libraries. The Fusion 360 entitlement in connection to solutions like VRED, NASTRAN, and ANSYS as well as Moldflow Advisor, opens up a unique workflow improvement on top of the best-in-class simulation performance. Our R&D roadmap will see Moldflow continue to be the best and most used solution in the market with a broad range of enhancements and updates, again, improved by the inclusion of the Fusion 360 capabilities. At Autodesk, we have a manufacturing center of excellence. We have the broadest, most comprehensive, best-in-class manufacturing solutions available today, and our customers are benefiting from the investments we are making in the expertise of our people. 600 software developers, plus our expert technical consulting teams, and growing specialized local partner network. We have ongoing de development and integration of our solutions and our advanced manufacturing facilities around the world. So that's where we are today. We talked about the threats, the opportunities facing manufacturers. How do we at Autodesk provide you with not only the tools you need today, but also the tools you will need tomorrow and enable you to seamlessly adapt your business needs change? We want to help you connect your workflows, automate your processes, and network with your entire supply chain. To do this, our solution is a single platform with your data at the center that provides seamless connection to manufacturing, automates repetitive workflows, it empowers decision makers through a bi-directional transparency, and adds intelligence based on your engineering criteria. It networks everyone to the process. It starts with creating a platform where design, engineering, and manufacturing can seamlessly coexist. With this platform, users will access the technology they need available on demand, have the ability to collaborate with all stakeholders from design to manufacturing, connect suppliers through service providers, and stay connected through development timelines. 
We call this Fusion 360, and it is a game changer. Fusion 360 connects design to manufacturing workflows on a single platform and common user experience, allowing insights across the whole process. For example, this opens up the possibility for manufacturing-led design. Designing a part for an additive process is very different from a part that you would design for a subtractive process. Insights from the manufacturing process can help you design the right part for manufacturing. Fusion 360 allows you to automate repetitive workflows and streamline design in the manufacturing process. It adds intelligence so that you can make more informed decisions. It helps you explore options faster when it comes to design and manufacturing process, allowing you more time to innovate. Fusion 360 networks people, processes, and applications to maximize productivity, allowing users to collaborate on design in real time across platforms. It connects with additional third-party technology so you can gain insights into your manufacturing cost and optimization design manufacturing process. Let's take a moment to look at something else that's included in Fusion 360. Generative design. In the context of not just design optimization, but design exploration. There is a lot of interest and excitement about the possibilities offered by generative design. For the past few years, you may have been reading and seeing headline statements from industry experts on generative design. These highlight some of the amazing possibilities that is combination of AI and infinite computing present for manufacturing. It could be a game changer. Autodesk are leading the industry in generative design technology and have been helping many marquee customers realize the potential it has to offer. Here are just a few who are seeing great results, including faster time to market, increased product performance, cost reduction, lighter, stronger products, weight and material reduction. One of the key requirements for generative design is the exploration of various manufacturing methods. Some people think gener generative design is only technology linked to an additive process. Autodesk also supports the traditional manufacturing methods that are widely available already, things like die casting, two and a half, three and five axis milling, and two axis cutting, which means you can use generative design with your existing equipment as it is not just for additive manufacturing, we are adding more manufacturing processes all the time. Bringing all these technologies together in a single unified collaborative environment removes the burden of seeing the data in different technologies separate from manufacturing. And it allows the ability to focus on the problem at hand. We believe such an approach will solve the future of challenges for manufacturers by making the most of the opportunity to harness all the new available technologies. It breaks the relentless linearity of process, increases transparency of manufacturing early in the design process, automates repetitive tasks, connects data from and to machines with a digital thread, and it provides a single connected instant on platform. Such an approach is critical to helping to generate dramatic productivity improvements and spurring innovation. Fusion 360 will continue to evolve. We update the platform every four to eight weeks, adding new features and making other improvements. We are also currently working to access additional manufacturing technologies influenced by our specialty tools, collaboration tools, and the ability to connect to the shop floor. Current customers will be brought along for the journey where you will continue to access the workflows in the current environment that you're used to, while also gaining access to the new platform as it grows. How will the products that you currently subscribe to look in the future as we continue to build this platform? We are continuing the investment in manufacturing technologies to keep our solutions best in class with continued improvements that will address critical needs and user experience, additional access to Fusion 360 and new expanded workflows, continued access to the environment that you're used to while also providing the choice of accessing the new tech in Fusion 360. Guided experience to learn the features and benefits of the next generation workflows. You get the best of both worlds and a pathway into the future of making things. 
Many thanks for allowing me the time to walk you through this. I hope it's helped you understand the Autodesk manufacturing strategy, the macro trends in drivers, our commitment to the great tool set we now have, and how we are investing to provide you with the tools you will need for the future today. I'm happy to answer any questions, go deeper into any specific topic, or discuss a need you have now or where you think we can help. Just let me know what's on your mind.